Hello everybody and welcome back to Final Fantasy 16 part 18. Part 18. <clears throat> we are on the Bloodlines main scenario which we started right before we ended uh, the last episode. Uh, so we're heading to uh, Amber, the, the village of Amber, which is somewhere. I, I think we're going to go, I don't know, I don't know where it is. So we'll just go this way. But welcome back everybody. How are you? Hello, good to see you. I went on a bike ride today. First bike ride I've gone on in a really long time. Uh, it was six miles and I hated most of it. But, uh, the bike I was using is my wife's old bike from, like, high school. <laughs> so, I've begun looking at potentially purchasing a new, a new two-wheeler. Uh, but we're not there yet. So, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get into biking. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do some more biking. Uh, also, hey, uh, change. I, I, I'm not really going to be doing anything on Twitter anymore. That it, I mean, I'll be very limited on Twitter. Uh, if you guys are or have uh, been invited, have an invite code to... Um, oh, jeez. How does this work? We just hit all of them then? We can. Very cool. Uh, if you guys have an invite code for Blue Sky, you can find me on there. As, uh, as CW719, same thing. I think that's going to be my primary social media thing from now on. I'm not into the idea of threads. I don't like Facebook. I check Facebook about once a month. I, already, I did delete Facebook like two years ago, but then I brought it back. Why did I bring it back? I brought it back for something. I don't know. Um, <clears throat> but if you guys are interested at all in, in, in my social media stuff, um, I would recommend that you... Uh, give me a follow on Blue Sky. I like it. It's, uh, it's... All of the, the bad people aren't there yet. They'll be there eventually, once it gets opened up entirely. But right now, you can only get it through invite codes. I don't know how you get invite codes. I think you just have to be there a while. I don't have any to give out. If I do, I, maybe I'll make an announcement in the video, and you guys can that's what get an invite code from me when I have one, but I don't have any yet. From here as well. but yeah, I think that's gonna be my jam. From now on. Uh, from now on. So we are just gonna make our way, make our way to Amber. We're gonna check out this area a little bit. I mean, anytime I see like a suspicious outcropping, um, like where I'm walking right now, you know, I can't help but think RPG. There's got to be something interesting tucked back here. There is. I don't know what it is. I don't know how to use it, but that's definitely a thing. Okay, well, <clears throat> not quite the payoff we all wanted, but that's okay. So I guess, um, inaccessible. Why don't we just go, we'll just go to our, we'll just go to our spot here. Go to our spot here. There it is. Oh. No, don't. Oh, hey, why aren't I using my chocobo? Chocobo. Oh, my God. It's... Oh, jeez. I don't know what to call it now. My brain's confused. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, jeez. I don't necessarily want to do that. I'm trying to... I'm not used to having the third option for my icons yet. 
I'm not gonna bring my chocobo now, we're 50 meters away. Uh, so every time you see me bring up my thunder, it's usually an accident. I'm trying to teleport. Mockery of justice is what it is. Lord Elwyn would never have stood for this. Quiet, you! Nothing but loyalists. Jill, look. Rosaria must be cleansed of the stain which befouls her, that she might rise once again from the ashes to welcome a new dawn. It <laughs> would be a pity to make examples of you all for the transgressions of but a handful. Of course, your lordship. You shall have our full cooperation. They're the bad guys. What business could the Black Shields have in a village this small? There is barely room to hide a bearer. I just realized how protected her hip is. Something else. You fancy dancing a gallows jig like the miller's son? All right. I heard you the first time. Um, yeah, I just noticed Jill has chainmail. Uh, maybe it's under her blouse as well, but <clears throat> it just looks like... If somebody's gonna slash her, she better hopes they slash for the hips. I ain't got much, but what's mine is yours, for a price. I was about to say, that doesn't, that's not right. Uh, I don't have any valuables. So there's nothing we want to sell. Cobalt tassels. Increases limit break generation amount by 6% when taking damage. No. Nah. Night terrors. Orchestrion roll. I should probably buy those, but I don't want to yet. I mean, I don't know. Feels like one of those things that I should definitely have. There you are. You won't be disappointed. Did I use my elixirs? Didn't I have to? Or maybe I never. Oh, I never bought any. I was going are. to, but I never did. Okay. And I'm still not going to. Speak with several of the villagers. <laughs> Two, to be specific. Excuse me, but what was all that about earlier? You haven't heard? Someone's been stirring up trouble. There have been attacks on the garrison, supplies stolen. They even say a black shield was murdered. Good. The Empire wants answers, and what the Empire wants, Empire gets. Don't they just... Keep your ears open, eh? The Black Shields will pay good coin for information on the culprits. You'd have to be dull as a sack of stones to think you could take on the Empire. Or their hundred full legions. We're going hunting for outlaws. How do you like that, boy? Do I not have a... Uh, I guess not. But did I not have a minimap? Am I making that up? There was a time my husband might have stood up to those men. Though back then... He wouldn't have needed to. And spools of steel silk. <clears throat> we haven't been able to craft anything in forever. There, I mean, at this point, the crafting in this game feels so secondary. Or, you know, that's maybe not the right word. Not even, it's, it's just so not emphasized. Um, who, who, where, what, who, you, okay, there. Word is, poor Isolde's closed her gates to all but the Highborn, and now a great camp sprung up along the walls. Can we do something to break up these clouds? It's been dreary for too long. You seen him, didn't you? I'm sorry. The Black Shields, just now. You seen him, didn't you? At least I think there was a Black Shields. I can't say I ever saw one before. Was this the first time they visited the village? What do you think? Amber's the arse end of nowhere. And they thought we might be harboring firebrands. Huh. It's a firebrand. Only we were. I might have turned him in and become a black shield myself. Oh, is that just a bear? Another another word for bear? You also, you're a dick. firebrands the Empire is looking for could be us, do you? Oh, no. Okay. But we need to find out. I just needed to wait for my 
explanation. Hello. Greetings, friend. We are travelers. I know that. What do you want? We couldn't help noticing those Imperial soldiers who were here earlier. Don't you go telling these strangers a thing. I speak for the people of this village, and we have nothing more to say to you. You are to leave Amber and never come back. May I at least ask why? What is everybody wearing on their hip? I don't know who you are or what brings you what, here. What is but that? Your presence puts us all in grave danger. The Empire is a harsh master. Its demands are great, and it's just as swift. But as long as we keep our heads down and pay our tributes, we are left alone. Some might call it submission. But if it will spare my people the Viceroy's wrath, then I will gladly submit. This village will not become another East Pole. Oh, you heard about that. Then we shall be on our way. These people live with a knife to their throat. In the mistaken belief that if they cooperate, my mother will show them mercy. Obedience bought with fear. God, I can't wait to just destroy that woman. Sorry, I... It's nothing. We still don't know who the Black Shields are looking for. Well, whoever they are. The Imperials deem them worth pursuing to the back of beyond. But other than Martha, who else in Rosari would have the courage to stand against the Empire? A new ally would certainly be welcome. Can we find them before the Imperials do? Perhaps the next village will yield more answers. Perhaps. Uh, Shallop Rock. Guess we're moving on. Not much going on in Amber. Um, this place, this path looks pretty linear. We'll probably check the entirety of this area, just because it's a bunch of straight this paths. Will take us through the mountains. And directly into the path of whoever or whatever lurks here. Fallen. Oh, these guys. Oh, we got a lot of points. We should probably go ahead and upgrade an ability. 963. Oh, let's see. It's 20, 575. We can upgrade. No, we haven't been using gouge. 525. We haven't been using Lightning Rod either. Man, I don't know what to do with these. What do we... Hmm. Greater Limit Break. Will of the Wikes. Ignition. It's so tough when we can only use... They give us so many abilities that we can only really use six at a time. We're using heat wave? No. What are we what are we doing? I have been using not gouge. Rook's Gambit. We'll do that. Oh, I just noticed it has like concentric circles around for how many levels you can upgrade it to. Kinda interesting. Um, should we change up our style a little bit here? Ignition is a little hard to control. Um, I 
It wouldn't be the worst thing to have a defensive spell, probably. But I'm more about that offense. So let's go back to Rising Flames. I like that one. I'm still good with those. Thunderstorm. Lightning Rod. Try Lightning Rod. Okay. There's something about the old... The old uh, Final Fantasy games that were just like, you would get fire, you'd get Fyra, you'd get Fyraga, and you could just use them. And there would be no problems. You would not have to worry about prioritizing this and that. I miss those days. It's just less complicated. I get it, though. You're going to do an action combat system. You can't... You can't have a bunch of menus popping up. You can't. You can't do that. I, I, I understand. Doesn't make me happy. <clears throat> Let's go wreck these boys. More of my mother's men. I want the mage. I hate toggling. Did this circle around? Maybe it, maybe it, maybe it did. I guess I didn't see the path through from where we fought those first guys. God, that hurts real bad. Holy smokes. I thought I could finish him beforehand. I could not. Is that a chest? That looks like a chest or something. I do with it? I don't know how it works. No idea. Anyway, what is this? Bull's Horn Braid, okay. Increases lunge damage by 5%. Mm. These accessories are not that exciting. So did this, does this wrap around? It did, okay. I just missed it. All the little uh, sparks flying off my limit gauge meter, by the way, uh, they throw me off sometimes. I feel like it's pointing me to a point of interest behind my HUD. Yeah, I've fallen for it at least a dozen times now. That's not true. It's like six. Half a dozen times.
Ah, oh, shoot, not that. So, okay, that doesn't that doesn't work that. Okay, every, everything I have right now is close range for my... My special abilities. Get off of my. I, I wish. I wish I didn't target that. I don't. I don't. I don't know how that works. Can I read that? Re read up on that. How do you? How do you do? Create a ball of lightning that, upon being struck. Oh. I don't like that. <laughs> We're going back to thunderstorm. So every time I attack it, it chains lightning to enemies. Eh. Oh shoot, I didn't mean to do it twice in a row. Oh well. Commit. I think we're close to where we need to be here. And I'm going to go ahead and say it. This music is being overused. Just the steady note. It's like the third area we've heard that just be the predominant. Uh, the predominant music. Blood, Clive. And still wet. You were told to stay in your homes. You know who we are, and still, you would bear your steel. Mm -hmm. Why then? We owe you our thanks. You have saved us the trouble of an interrogation. You're welcome. To dwell in darkness, that we may purge the night and welcome lasting dawn. On these, our swords we swear. So they have to say that every time? Say that again. Say that to my face one more time. Oh man. I didn't know I didn't have that ready to go yet. This is all day. Are you still not dead? Jeez. Come on. Come on. Gargle. I was trying to hit him with my my special. Bad dog. Just kidding. I don't mean that. Good dog. Great dog. Tell me what I want and the end will be swift. Who are you looking for? <sighs> Why you? We come bearing a message. Your friends have been found. The branded you freed from our camps. <laughs> they await you in Ordil. Guardians of the Flame. 
Those are Old Hill's gates. Then we hurry. Go, go, go. That's better. Yeah, I needed I needed a little pick me up. Something, boy. Death. Found her. Well. Is this the friend? This was my mother's doing. But why? Why would anyone... I don't know. I never truly understood her. But this... Oh, Clive. I don't know. I will learn what madness drives her, and I will end it. Waving your hands at crows on a roof probably isn't gonna shush them away, but that's fine. We got the message. We should go. Yes. We can't get <clears throat> them here like this. Um, make for Port Azolde. Okay, so that's down there. We won't. Let's just check up here first. The Black Shields have made it this far south. They may already be in Port Azolde. Looking for items. Items and stuff. Do 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 do. I don't think there's gonna be any items. And there probably definitely won't be any other people. And that guy, uh, that gate is up. Hey, an item. Ten chunks of wire it. Crafting materials for a game that has no crafting. This was a nice beach. Here comes the this the singular tone again. I mean, I get it. It's a, it's a it's a depressive game. And there's there's or an oppressive game, I guess I should say, with a very you know uh, sad, mournful tone to it. Um, I just I don't know. It's a decision. In honor of the 250th anniversary of the founding of the Grand Duchy of Rosaria. 
Okay. They tell us there's a curfew, but they refuse to surprise it. They're all Rosarian. But this is their home. I am excited to like really dive into what's going on with why his mother is so damn twisted. I mean, she was a bitch back, you know, 18 years ago when we were playing Young, Qu uh, Young Clive. I, but I don't, I mean, most evil thing ever was not, you know, I didn't see that coming for her. Yeah, Thunderstorm is great to have just because it's got some range to it. Okay. You didn't quite get him. These guys just pop out of the ground? They must have, huh? It's another nice beach, minus the monstrous crabs. And the lack of sunshine. That seems to be a newer development, though. for level up. I feel like we, we gotta be getting close. Where is it? It's somewhere. Attributes? There it is. Oh yeah, we're close. 198. The Lazarus. What happened to this place? The Lazarus? My mother happened. The nobles who lived here didn't stand a chance. Let's hope my uncle fared better. We should start with the main Oh, that's gates. right. I forgot who our contact was. I remember now. We're on the way to meet... Uh, I forgot his first name, but Clive's uncle. Uncle... Uh, Rossfield. That's the main gate. And it looks like we're not the only ones hoping to get in. Can we just set them all on fire? I thought we might be able to reason with the guards. Or at least bribe them. I suspect everyone in that crowd thought the same. Was that the only way in? Officially, yes. Strictly speaking, no. My uncle once told me that the nobles had tunnels built so that they could visit town without having to walk amongst the rabble. The Lazarus. What, what is the Lazarus? 
We'll find our way into the city there. If you're sure. And the entire place looked abandoned. Do you think it's safe? As long as it is abandoned. Black light burns. Okay. Wasn't really expecting a the good news main is scenario switch the there. Black shield since Old Hill. I don't Maybe really want to go down there. We're looking for. Oh, run the sprint. Yes, thank you. Oh, I gotta start using my chocobo. I'm not gonna use it in town here, but I've gotta. I wonder how combat works with a chocobo, by the way. Can I? Can I? I probably have to get off, eh? Maybe I just blow past fights? I don't know. Because I don't necessarily want to do that. I want to keep getting experience and ability points. The Lazarus District. This okay, is it is a district. Like I remember it. How quickly a crown can lose its luster. Again, I'm grateful for the white diamonds, otherwise that's, I would miss almost every chest in the game. We. Not abandoned then. Oi! Visitors! Apologies. We'll show ourselves out. Man. Are they... are they... bandits? Hmm. We don't even know what side you're on. What are we... what are we doing? So they are bandits, okay. According to their titles. Wow. Kind of cool finish. It looked like the ice came for me, but it it didn't. Obviously. 60, 24 ability points. And we might have enough to upgrade something. Steel silk and a gill bug. I've only ever seen one man fight like that. And he's long dead. It's Wade! Then perhaps it's time you joined him. Is it Wade? The blessing of the Phoenix. It can't be. I was there when you died. No, maybe that's not Wade. Are you Wade? So did just everybody actually survive Phoenix Gate? Forgive me, my lord. I knew not whom I addressed. You have naught to fear from us. Founder, it really is you. It's Wade. It's Wade, right? So wait. <laughs> Tyler didn't make it though, right? He seemed to have died before our eyes. We can speak inside. Wade never lost the floppy hair. And those who wouldn't bend the knee? We left before the Empire could make examples of us, though we didn't go far. And we banded together to form the Guardians of the Flame soon after. Alas, 
There is only so much a handful of aging shields can do against the might of an empire. There's a handful less now. I did just kill like eight of your men. But we've seen to it that their stay has been anything but pleasant. Of late, though, we've had our hands full just trying to keep the Duchy's few remaining bearers out of the Imperial's clutches. The Cullings. We saw what happened in Old Hill. Aye, the foul work of the Black Shields and their mistress. You mean my mother? But it doesn't make sense. Even knowing what I know about her. Her hatred for bearers was no secret, but... She wouldn't have been ignorant of their value to the realm. No offense, my lord. But in case you haven't noticed, the Lady Annabella couldn't care less about the realm. She barely even cares for her own home. That much has been plain since the slaughter at Eastpool. And, since granting the Holy Emperor a new heir, her obsession with bearers only seems to have grown. As to why, I don't know. Maybe she can't bear the thought of anyone having the power to challenge her beloved son. Her son. So, like, so wait, stepbrother? So <laughs> broken camp. They march in full force no, for brother-in-law. Step, stepbrother. So yeah. do we. Make ready. This is their main host. If we remove the head, perhaps... Perhaps we can prevent what happened at the docks from happening somewhere else. If I do nothing, then the blood of their next victims will be on my hands. Yours and ours. We too have witnessed the crimes these men who dare call themselves shields have committed in my mother's name. It cannot be allowed to continue. We must put a stop to this madness. We must. So let us go with you. For the good of Rosaria. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Very well. If that is your wish, I would be honored to serve at your side. And we at yours. So, Wade, let us do our duty. With pleasure, my lord. Ah, oh, man. It's good to have... I, 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 I liked my 20 minutes with Wade earlier in the game. I imagine this endeavor will require more than just our weights. Then let's Please? hope Sir Wade has a good quartermaster. Uh, do we have any, I, 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 well, hmm, let's, let's continue exploring here. I, I don't know, I might, I might just, before we start this next quest. I suppose we owe you our thanks. are not dead. You spared us when you could have just as easily sent us to the mud. Oh, we didn't kill them. I tried. Um, maybe we go back to the hideout and just see if there's anything new going on there. We haven't been back there in a while. welcome to what little we have managed to salvage. It will just take a thousand of your gold. Gil, sorry, sorry. A desert rose. We don't have any. It's used for crafting. Let's buy ten just in case we need them. It's only four hundred. As you wish, my lord. Which seems super inexpensive. May the blessing of the crystals go with you. Tell us then, Sir Wade. Maybe we won't go back yet. What is your plan? Nothing fancy. You, Lady Jill, and I make for Buett Bridge and provoke the main host at their encampment. Sensing an opportunity to end the Guardians, the Black Shields will call for reinforcements, who will be met from the rear by parties of my brothers hidden throughout the surrounding hills. This will allow us to wage battle on the bridge without fear of being overwhelmed. While the Black Shields have an advantage in numbers, you see, they prefer to fight in small units, which we can use to our advantage. How small exactly? Small enough, now that I have you and Lady Jill for company. Huh. 
I doubt I could have done this on my own. But until we arrived, that was your plan. <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. So wait. The bearers from Old Hill have been laid to rest. Very good. Now make ready for battle. As you command. It kind of looks like young Wade. Thank you, Sir Wade. Perhaps now they will find peace. There is but one thing which will grant them peace. Putting an end to the Black Shields. And so we shall. I accept. Okay. Party members. Throughout the main scenario, Clive will often be joined by various companions who are keen to lend their assistance. However, depending on Clive's destination, they may choose to remain behind at the hideaway. All right. Uh, I don't know if I needed a tutorial for that. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I don't know. I guess speaking of... Oh, now we can't fast travel. Okay. Wheel. Let's go back. May the blessing of the Phoenix go with you. And also with you. How long have you been pursuing the Black Shields? Since they burned their first village. We tracked down the bastards responsible and fed their corpses to Stillwind. Suffice to say, that got their attention. It's been a game of cat and mouse ever since. So, looks like we're just walking back to where we came from. I got me sideways. Come along now. Bugger me sideways. The bastards are looking. There they are. On your command, my lord. Give me enough to level up. I just feel a little better if my health was full without using any items. What is it now? I told you. We bear a message for the Vicerine. From the Guardians of the Flame. Ha! You presume to tell us that a pair of filthy vagabonds, a woman and a dog... It's a big dog. ...could guard aught against the might of the Black Shields. Then come! These guys are the most not intimidating. They, they kind of hype up the way that he talks and stuff, but it's like some of the easiest... This game, and I've, I've seen some people comment on this, this game is not difficult. Um, like at all. I think, I think I have died in one boss fight earlier. Um. But I, I don't think it was due to the difficulty. I think it was like a mechanic I was maybe not wrapping my head around. I don't remember, but it's not... Not, it's not bad. It's, it's just, it's, it seems relatively simple. And I don't know if there was, I don't remember if there was a difficulty spike or not. More enemies. More dragons. Oh, don't do that. Pew, 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 pew. There we go. Ooh, another dragoon. The nobles stand, albeit a misguided one. <laughs> In taking it, 
You have but proven our point. That this land is in dire need of cleansing. I hate the enemies in this game. I do. I just, I hate them so much. simple to dodge. Enough. Those dragoons certainly haven't gotten any more difficult. With, with three icons, I can just, I, I mean, I can't necessarily spam things. Like, there's still the cooldown timers and stuff, but as long as I can keep them busy while those cooldowns go, it's 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 pretty easy. Imperial Link, Dragon Talon, crafting stuff, I guess. I don't see any more. Nor do I. The plan worked. It did. It bloody worked. We sent every last one of the rotten bastards straight to the mud. My, uh, Lord. Perhaps this will be enough to stop the Cullings. For the time being, at least. Perhaps. Though I doubt my mother will take this loss well. She'll move swiftly to see her minions' ranks replenished. And then it will all begin again. Guess we'll have to kill her. The nation we once knew is gone for good. Her fields rot. Her people starve. We battle to preserve the flame that was, but for every foe we fell, another springs up in its place. Yet be that as it may, it is still our home. And we must fight for it. As we always have and always will. For as long as the Firebird's flame burns in our hearts, the Duchy cannot die. And her loyal subjects may dream of a day when the Rosarian Standard flies over Rosalith once more. So I die. Think we should fall back to Port Azolder before the garrison sends reinforcements? A sound strategy, my lord. <laughs> sure. That's what I was going to say. 100%. Black or white. And that is enough to give us another... Uh, uh, I forgot what they're called. The, the green things. 85 was our next threshold for something. It was question marks. Can this be our new hideaway? It's already fully furnished. And how long has my uncle been funding you and your comrades' endeavors? Since the beginning. Lord Byron was the first person I turned to after forming the Guardians. And had I known of this tunnel back then, I wouldn't almost have been hanged by the city guard for trying to sneak over the wall. I suppose a formal request for an audience would have appeared suspicious. And appearances must be maintained. Were the Vice Regency to catch wind of Lord Byron's involvement in our movement, they'd seize his estate and send him to the gallows, where he would be of no use to anyone. And so, though it sickens him to the soul, he plays the part of the loyal Lord, knowing that one wrong move might prove his downfall. It is why he remains ever vigilant. 
Don't be surprised if he refuses you an audience. Especially since you're famously dead. Then I will have to think of a way to prove that I am neither wraith nor wrongdoer. I might have something which could help with the latter. It's the mark of the Guardians. Display it and those who love Rosaria will know where your loyalties lie. The seals are a big gameplay mechanic. Wear it with pride. Be sure that you do. I don't want my men attacking you again. Unless you deserve it. But like not a mechanic at all. If only Sir Tyler could have been here to see you. Or the Lord Commander. Thank you, Sir Wade. If there is ever anything you need. I know. Go on now, my lord. All right. Port Isolde. So where we've been, right? Rossfield Manor. How accommodating. Do you really think they believe we are who we say we are? Not a chance. Oh. <laughs> I have to guess my uncle believes we're imposters here to rob him. And means to string us up himself. Imagine my surprise when I was told my nephew had come to visit. Clive Rosfield died long ago. And for uttering his name here, you shall pay with your tongue. Oh, I don't have my sword. You would mock me as well. It is I, Sir Crandall of Camelot, loyal servant to Her Serene Holiness, Saint Sybil the Unshard. Meadow, thou vile sorcerer, for thy crimes against church and crown, I shall have thy head. Curse the infectious flax wench. Even in death, must thou plague me still? Very well. I shall open the gates of hell that thou might see thy charge once more. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty awesome. I like that. Bravo, Uncle. You're still the finest matter in the twins. Oh, oh, oh. oh, Clive, my dear boy, it's really you. <laughs> you always were fond of that scene from the saint of the sanctuary. Never did let me play Sir Crandall. <laughs> I have a favor to ask, Uncle Byron. Rutherford, inform the kitchens. There'll be guests. We dine immediately. But, Uncle... You can't very well regale me with the tale of your miraculous preservation on an empty stomach. Go on, sit. I see that you use the good plates, Rutherford.
That was heartwarming. So you arrived late to one of her cullings, did you? Since becoming viceroy, Annabella has been a constant thorn in Rosaria's side, but these atrocities are a new low. Something has changed. Quite what? I don't know, but the woman we knew is gone, and a monster sits in her place. A monster? For better or worse, I've been charged with governing this town, and thus must maintain the illusion of obedience. That's all I can do to aid Wade and his merry band of revolutionaries. So he's told us. You have risked much for Rosaria. Our nation will be forever in your debt. Oh, I do not have high hopes for Byron. I just, it's going to end poorly for him. I'm already it's been sad about it. Years, Clive. <clears throat> 18. The nation your father and your forefathers fought to defend is no more. Perhaps it would be otherwise had I the courage of my brother. All right, if it's a ship you require, a ship you shall have. I have a galley in port but recently relieved of her cargo. She can be outfitted for the voyage in a matter of weeks. So you believe us, then? About everything? Believe you? Ha! Only a fool would believe even half of the things you claim. But until tonight, only a fool would have believed my nephew still lived. And besides, I have it on good authority that Clive is telling the truth. Whose authority? On your own, of course. You've always been a terrible liar. Is that true? It's not untrue. Let's say no more about it, eh? It wouldn't do to linger on my nephew's greatest failing. The one thing I cannot believe, though, is all this about you being Sid. You were always such a good boy, but now you're quite the outlaw. Which, if I'm not mistaken, would make me an outlaw's uncle. <laughs> right then, who shall we pillage first? Rutherford, fetch me thy cutlass. This will be fun. I like Byron. Byron's awesome. Obviously, we're running a little long. We'll see. Uh, we'll see how long these cutscenes go. Uh, over there. Go on. She's a fine ship, isn't she? Once outfitted, she'll bear us across the boiling sea to Drustinus in the space of three days. What is Jill hiding? Clearly something. something on your mind. Monsters. When I served the Iron Kingdom, I, I did so because I saw no other choice. Because once they learned that the Lash would not move me, they turned it on those who could. And so I became their puppet. I let them pull my strings, telling myself it was not my hand that swung the sword, but another's. I removed myself from the truth so I wouldn't feel the pain it caused. And before I knew it, I no longer felt anything, anything at all. I had become a monster. Jill. Yeah. 
I don't want to be a monster, Clyde. Do you understand? You know, that's actually a good point. We haven't seen her transform into Shiva. I want to choose a different path, a better path. Since the very beginning of the game, right? I don't think we have. To live on my own terms. But before I can do that, I need to come to terms with my past. And when you do, I'll be standing there with you, just as you stood with me. Thank you, Clive. Kiss her. I must atone for my sins. Only then, when it's done, will the monster cease to be. Just... Promise me that you won't die with it. Now, let's get some sleep. The journey back to Bendemir is long, and there is much to tell the others. Sexual tension between those two is... dick. All right, going back to the hideaway. Uh, I won't make the same mistake I did last time. I cannot save on this screen, so we will go to the hideaway. Here be monsters. Only the founder knows what awaits us in the Iron Kingdom, but Vivian could probably make an educated guess. Okay. New missives, all kinds of good stuff. So we'll have plenty of stuff to check in the next episode of Final Fantasy 16, which will be part 19. Thank you guys for hanging out for this one. All kinds of stuff going on. Uh, we met Byron. Seems great. I really super hope nothing bad happens to him. Such a jovial fella. But uh, we'll find out. Have a great rest of your day. Thanks for hanging out. Bye-bye.